Hi, welcome back to This Mama Loves. And I'm going to do a haul video today. So, we have quite a few things here <laughs> that I got. Got some goodies from NYX to L and Ulta. So, I think I'm going to start with the Ulta items first. I don't know what the lighting is. It can get better lighting. How does that? That's not the move. <laughs> The sun is setting, and it just—I think like that's worse. And I hit the camera. All right, guys, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna—we gonna, gonna leave that light. <laughs> we gonna leave that light. Okay. All right. So, can adjust this light. Does that do anything? All right. That's what we're going to work with, the desk light. Okay, so let's get started. And I'm going to make it quick. Um, all right, so let's get some scissors to just get to opening. I actually have another haul that I'm going to do. I'm going to do that one with um, what I eat in a day because... Um, it's more related to that, so I'm going to do it with, in my next, well, might, might not be next, but within a what I eat in a day. Hold on one moment, that's, alright, sorry about that, that was my husband, I forgot to send him the shopping list that I need him to get some things for, <laughs> so, alright, so let's get back to it, alright, so, now I don't know why they do this, but they break up, like I feel like, just keep all the items until they're all ready and then ship them all out. Don't break them up into different shipments. But anyways, I actually opened up one of the bags already because it has something for my daughter and she really, really wanted it. And I bought her a blush. I bought her um, a Wet n Wild blush in, what's it called? Mellow Wine or something like that. So she really wanted it. She's out with her friend, spending the night out. She wanted to take it with her. So, all right. So, in that package, I got the Wet n Wild makeup remover. And this is actually going to be for her as well. Um, I, th I, forgot, I, I forgot to tell her that I bought her this. So, she's been having some skin issues. So, it does say it's gentle. So, I'm hoping it's okay. We've, we've actually taken it to the dermatologist. And they gave her prescription creams for it. And that's actually been helping her face. And so she's at the point now where the dermatologist says she just needs to use the creams as needed. So she has a flare up or something, just use it for a few days and she's fine. So I am trying to be conscious of what's on her face, as is she. So there's certain things that she doesn't like to put on her face because she just wants to be careful. But her skin's been doing pretty good, so... I bought her this makeup remover and I got me this eyeliner. Now I like a pop of color, especially if I'm wearing like a very neutral eyeshadow and I really want to get back into really putting on makeup again and it's been a minute. It really has. But I like a pop of color on my under eye, especially if I do like a neutral eye, like the neutral browns. And can I open this? <laughs> can I? It's so hard. Okay. So this is from LA, LA Girl. And this is their shock wave. So it's a neon. So we'll see. So it's a green. It's a neon. What's the color called? Gotcha. So. I got this, uh, I don't know, we'll see. So there is a green, it's called Mildew. It's um, Urban Decay Eyeliner, Mildew, and I love that color. It's, mm, I don't wanna say muted, but kind of muted, but kind of shimmery green eyeliner, and I love that color for my under eye. This is a lot brighter, so I don't know about this one. We'll see. It's not really my daughter's cup of tea either, but 
I'll give it to her. Maybe she'll play around with it. So this is the one I had already opened up, so I can give her her blush. But here's the rest in this package. All right. They had when I bought a lot of these things, a lot of, some of these things were on sale. One of the things that was on sale was this NYX Total Control Pro foundation. Drop, it's a drop foundation. So I've had their other one. The, it wasn't pro. It was just their drop foundation, the Total Control. And I used to wear this like years back. It's been a long time since I've worn it. And I did like that foundation. Now the color I had before I felt like was a little light for me. And when I went on the Ulta website, the color I thought I probably should get, they didn't have. Now, I don't know, because it's also summer. So we'll see. But this is the color Almond, which I think might be a scotch dark for me. Which is why I have a NYX haul. So I went to their website. So I guess you test on your inner arm. Yeah, it's going to be a little dark for me. A little dark and warmer than what I like. I like neutral undertone for me. Moving on. I got this. This is the first time I got their fat oil. I got it in the color... What color? Scrolling. I got it in the color scrolling. So it's a brown shade. They have different colors. If I like it, because I really love lip oils now. Yeah, see, look at that. That's not my shade. I don't know if you can see. Because of the lighting. Kind of. It's a little too reddish undertone, I guess, for me. I also got this milky gloss in the color cherry scrim cherry skimmed cherry cherry scrim i guess we'll try we'll swatch it why not that's what it looks like but it'd be nice with a nice lip liner and, and then this is our this our final ultra bag yes this is our final ultra bag Oh, no, it's not. There is one more. Is it? Okay. Let's see. Let's see what this is. I thought there was four. And again, sometimes it's like a waste. Like, you saw the one bag had just two items in it. This one bag. This one bag, literally. Come on. <laughs> I feel like we should be able to wait until everything is ready. But anyways, this is a little rock. It's like a refill, but I don't have, I don't care. <laughs> I like the shade. This is a opal eyeshadow in the color, does it say a color? I don't see a color. But I thought this would be nice, like in the center. Ooh, oh. Jumping Jiminy Crickets in the center of the lid. Oh, the color is opal. Okay. That's the color opal. Let's do a little swatch. Feels a little grainy, but going on, it's kind of smooth. So that's... I thought that would be a nice center lid color. So the color opal. And I've never used Lorac eyeshadow before to be quite honest all right so the last bag. that is really shameful for me one bag for that one little eyeshadow meanwhile this one is stuffed it's stuffed <laughs> so this is this was actually two separate Ulta orders that I did kind of back to back but I got this is the Good Molecules Overnight Exfoliating Treatments. And I got this because I'm going to be out of my... Well, it was on sale, so I got it. But I got it so when I'm out of my um, 
I have the what is it called? This uh, uh, AHA whatever the fully that I have. I can't remember the name now. Okay, then I got this eyeshadow palette from Revolution, and these are the colors. Oops, these are the colors in the palette. So I'm not gonna open it, but I love this packaging. I love mandalas. I love mandalas. Like here's the case to my candle. I love mandala. Okay, and then here's another one. Now I haven't decided if I'm gonna keep this or give this one to my daughter, but this is also from Revolution or Makeup Revolution, whatever. Uh, can I open this? The side taped. Is my taped? Oh, there is the tape. Let's see if I can get it. <laughs> okay. Is that tape still holding on? It is. Okay. There we go. So this is what the inside looks like. I don't know. I think she still has eyeshadow. I think I'll probably keep that for me. I got this e.l.f. lip exfoliator. I'm always looking for good exfoliators. I'm I'm not a fan of the ones in pots. However, my favorite, one of my favorite ones. I have two. One by Lush. And the other one is by, was it Fresh? Their lip exfoliator, I really like it, even though they're both in pots, but I really like them. And then this is Elf, their uh, lip balm. Just, okay, FYI, my family, my father's side, from my father, we have lip issues where they are very dry, they chap very easily, they will crack, and they will bleed. So... I lovingly passed this on to my daughters, although my youngest doesn't have it as bad. But my eldest daughter, she's pretty much where I'm at with the lip thing. So I keep them. We always have on hand. Bliss decks for the girls. And I use the CeraVe ointment. Sarah does, actually. I use this for my lips. But I have really been getting into lip oils, which is why I bought this to try out. I love the NYX. They're what was it it was like their cannabis whatever line and they had oil and i loved it i loved it Linoge, Linage, how do you say it i love those but they're pricey so i don't really buy that but i heard this is a good dupe but anyways i can't never have enough of those kinds of things i keep one in my pocketbook one in here in the bathroom in my bedroom I got this color corrector from LA Girl. This is the orange one, I believe. So I do usually for my under eyes if I use it. It's a really good color corrector. And this is a repurchase I've used for years and years and years. And it's been a while since I've used it. So I decided to re-up on it since it was on sale. And then I have oh another two eyeliners from LA Girl. I'm not swatching these. They're your basic black and a brown. Brown sugar is what this one is called. And it's um, metallic. I wanted to start trying to use brown eyeliners. Is this one metallic too? Let's see. Metallic eyeliner. This is neon. How, how can black be neon? It's called blackout. <laughs> how can black be neon? whatever and I think that's it yes so that's it for Ulta now let's get into Elf so for Elf because I got these I don't know if they sell this on Ulta they might but I went to the Elf website because they were having um, like a double points thing or double I forget what you call it cash back thing for um, Rakuten and to let you know, I always have links in my description. I have a link, like a referral link for Rakuten, where you get a little something, I get a little something. I have a referral link for Weight Watchers. You get a little something, I get a little something, like a discount or something like that. I think that discounts might change every few months. I'm not sure, but it's always down there. It's always in my videos if you want to click on that link. But 
I wanted to purchase the full size of this because let me tell you how this is uh, amazing. This is the truth right here. Okay. This is the Els Blemish Breakout Breakthrough Triple Acid Resurfacing, Resurfacing Serum. This is the truth. Okay. You have a breakout. This is going to put in work. In a few days, breakout who? <laughs> and I have like little, um, they're actually clearing up now. I'm out. So I haven't even been able to treat them. But I've had some like over on this brow. I get repeat ones here around my nose. I get um, sometimes here, sometimes here, or here or here. Those are my usual suspects when I have a breakout. This thing, let me tell you when I say it puts in work. I still have the little bottle. So I'm going to put some of this in the little bottle and give to my daughter. But this is the truth. This works great. They have a, a face wash and a lotion as well. I don't really use those. I actually gave it to my daughter, which she said it was helping clear up her skin. I just, this is all I need. I, this is all I need. This right here. But I think it's like $18, but it's worth it. This right here, get you some. You breaking out, get you some. Okay, get you some. Also, I decided to get this eyelash. I didn't think they had one also, but mm, I was on Elf. <laughs> this lash and roll mascara is supposed to be good for curling and lifting my lashes. The little bit I have, because I don't have much, they like to just fall. They just fall. They're sad. So we'll see how that works. And then I decided to try the hello hydration eye cream i think this is the mini if i'm not mistaken there's no thingy in there i believe this is the mini that i got this is the it has hyaluronic acid and peptides now i think i might have i think i might have this actually do i i have another elf eye cream it might be a hello hydration one as well but i do enjoy the eye cream so I got this mini, which I don't think you can get on Amazon. All right, last thing. Let's move on to NYX. So like I said, the reason why I went to NYX was I wanted to get the other shade. And then I could probably mix and stuff like that. Actually, I have other shades of foundation that's a little light for me that I could probably add this to. And I think some of the other stuff I got here from this was on sale too. I didn't get much. Get much. Okay, well that's more than what I thought I got. Anyway, see here's the this is the drops and this is in caramel. So let's see how caramel is gonna do us. So you can see the difference. I think caramel might be actually too light, which is probably why I got it then. The other one I had, it was something caramel, I feel like. But they didn't, they, they don't have that shade in this. So, let's do this. We'll do it next. Okay, so here is caramel. And we'll just blend that in. Caramel, I think, actually is closest to my actual shade. See that? That's caramel. Over here is almond, and here is caramel. I think caramel might be it. And maybe we could add a little smidge of almond with it. Who knows? Anyways, I also got their serum blush in the color Sienna Bronze. So I'm not going to open this. Because I have other blushes. I want to crack it open and start the whole process of, okay, well, you only got like this serum to use it. <laughs> kind of thing. Is that it? All right. So, like I said, I'm not going to open that because I don't want to start the process. Oh, I did get the other lip oil. So, this is the, this I like to use at night before bed. This will probably just, you know, during the day, whatever. This I love at night before bed. I 
when I do my face routine, my skincare routine. And then this is their Bear With Me Cannabis Sativa Seed Oil. And it's the lip conditioner, it says. This is so good. It's so good. This I, has to be my third or fourth one that I've bought. So let's let's put it like that. Okay. This eyeliner is their retractable eyeliner in the color aqua green. Again, we're going for that under eye pop of color thing. And I'll swatch this. If I can even get it open. Okay. So here's what it looks like. And I'll swatch it next to that neon green thing. Oh yeah. See, I like that. I like that blue. It's nice metallic-y color. I like that. So I, like I said, I like these. Like a little pop of color if I'm wearing like a neutral eyeshadow kind of thing. And then I got two of their... This is the same color. One is for me, one is for my daughter. This is the uh, Butter Gloss, which I love NYX Butter Gloss. I cannot tell you how many. I have, I have a few on my desk right now. Right? Okay. <laughs> Here, look at this. I got in my desk. This is just in my in my drawer, in my desk. Okay. I like NYX Butter Glosses. <laughs> so my daughter picked out this color, and I was like, oh, I like that color. I'm going to get me one, too. So this is in the color Rocky Road, and I'll swatch mine. So I got two. Why do they look kind of like they could be different shades? Is it me? Oh, no. Okay. All right. So I'm going to swatch one. I'm going to swatch mine. And here's Rocky Road. Oh, I like that. So that's what that looks like. She had, I'm, let me put hers aside. I'm going to put hers there so it's not with my stuff. And then I got this Smooth Whip. This is supposed to be a matte lip cream. This is, I'm trying to think, was this a free sample? I think this was a free sample, actually, yeah. So this is the color Cherry Cream. And let's see, Matte Whip. Cherry cream. There we go. Oh yeah, I would wear this. I have um, a lip liner. What is that lip liner? It's NYX Vintage. Yeah, Vintage. I think would look great with this. What I would do with this is I would put the Vintage lip liner all over my lips, and then just dab this around, like in the center. Yes, ma'am. All right. So that is my haul. I hope you liked it. Stay tuned. I have, I don't know what sequence my videos are going to come out in. I have a what I eat in a day to put out. That's That one is not going to have the haul that I said was going to be coming up. It'll be the one after that, I believe. Um, I actually might have two what in the eating days actually coming up after this. And then the one that will have that haul. Um, it's uh, a skinny syrups haul. That will be in probably after those two of the what I eat in a day. So I'm trying to get on it. I've filmed these things. I just need to edit. <laughs> That's all. I need to edit. So. All right, so I think that will be it for this haul. And if you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. And I hope to see you again soon. Bye.